Well, back at it again. I've actually been at it all day. I started at 4.30 this morning, so calling it quits a little, a little earlier. Uh, the machine beat me up real good today being digging on the well. I didn't completely finish, but I got a pretty good pile of spoils out of it. see the bottom down there I got about another two and a half feet to go or so and I'll be there let's go down the well as for the groundwater that's a, that's a different story. I do have some groundwater, as you can see. Uh, starts right up in there. It's pretty shiny. It runs down to right there. Not even enough to make a puddle. Do got a little bit of groundwater though. So what I'm gonna do is plan C. It's my only choice. Which is, you know, I got to thinking it's probably good that I don't have a lot of groundwater coming in because then it would flood out this uh, well hole that I have to work in still. So I think I'm gonna just, I'm gonna put about three foot of gravel in here, put Tyvek over the top of it, and then cover this big hole here back up and I'll just leave the well hole open for the next time when I'm here dusty the winds blowing the dust down in here so sometime when I drain the pond do the tie-in directly to the pond I'll just mark right where the end of this is and the depth and then when I drain the pond I can measure back down and I know where I need to dig in at and that will fix it up all this is gonna have a bunch of rock down it anyway big rock uh, sloping down into the water so I think it'll, it'll be all right the gravel filter the water it's quite a bit of gravel it's gonna be about 30 foot of gravel it'll go through a little windy today too so tomorrow it's kicking the dust up not pleasant so tomorrow I'm gonna move all these spoils if I can they've all got to go back up there anyway I'll backfill the, around the well later with some spoils that I dig out for the pond when I extend the pond out so I think tomorrow there's the edge of the where I stopped on the road and here's the other road so I think I can get to that road with what I've got here maybe a little past it be nice to see that happen. I still need quite a bit more uh, you know, material though to make the road the way I want it. But if I can get it close, it's better than where it was. It was a nice sunny day today. Temperatures are real pleasant too. I got up there and dusted off my solar panels. They were, they were pretty bad. So tonight, Tonight, I believe I will be having what a skirt steak. It's uh, folded over itself, so it's about twice the length, about a half inch thick, and potatoes. Uh, I'll probably do tomatoes. I still got some tomatoes left. 
I still got a, a cinnamon roll for Sparky, but Sparky hadn't been here the last couple of nights. I don't know what happened to him. Hopefully the owl didn't get him. There's a little bitty owl that hangs around here. It is what it is. Nature is pretty, pretty tough out here. You got to be quick. Well, I'll talk to you all in the next one.